How I look, y'all? I look, a, I look a little messy. Hold on. Let me put a little bit of... Look up a little dry. I'm going to put a little bit of Vaseline on my face because I look a little dry. Yeah. Put a little Vaseline on my face. My face look a little dry. So, I don't know yet. All in here. Are you guys all in here? Because I want to talk to you guys about something. Want to talk? I want to. I want to address some things, like, cause it's like, bitch, y'all playing with me. Stop playing with me. Stop playing. All right. So. Where do I start, right? Where do I start? By a start. All right. So let me start it off, right? Let me start it off. So, you see a lot of my fans, a lot of my fans be <laughs> badging me and be dragging me because they don't like when I address things. They don't like when I address things. They don't like when like people that like are down here. They don't like when people that are down here start with me. They don't like when I respond to them. But sometimes it's like bitches will pick, pick, pick until you bite their fucking finger off. And I'm going to talk to you guys about this little situation about the, about me and this girl. So let me tell you about the situation about with me and this girl, right? So I put this record out, right? I put this record, um, like what, right? Sampling the Missy Elliott beat. And this girl on Twitter, she subbed me. She threw me a little sub on Twitter and everything. And I ignored it. Because it's a sub with no name. So it's like, I'm just going to ignore you. Um, I don't know why she would be upset about that. Because so many people have sampled that beat. Flo Millie, uh, the guy, the boy named Slim God, some shit like that. He sampled the beat. But, you know, the girl subbed me because she thinks that I probably copied her. Because she got a song out with the same beat. But that's why I put on my Instagram channel the day that I did the song. I did the song last year. Early, all right, whatever. I ignored that, right? Then the second time that she subbed me, she did. She, I don't. She subbed me, but my name was included in it. I don't know if somebody tagged me and she responded to it. Now that my name is in it, now that my name is in it, now you 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 addressing me. So when you address me and it's not a sub, I'm gonna address you. So I got her number. I got her number and I called her, right? I called her and I recorded it because you you just never know with these hoes. I recorded it and I'm not even gonna lie. The conversation started very nasty. It started very nasty, very aggressive. I was coming at her and she was coming at me. But then I called her back because, I called her back because, and look, I ain't gonna I'm lying. Online. I got the whole conversation. I could put the whole 35 minutes up. Like, I have the whole conversation. Because you saying that I'm copying you. And also, also, this is my thing though, right? Yeah. No, this the thing. conversation started real nasty, right? It started real nasty. And then I called her back because I'm so appalled at the fact that she thinks that I'm copying her or that I'm stealing from her. Because... There's nothing that she do that I that I like. I don't like her music. I don't like her style. I don't like how she look. I don't like nothing about her. I don't even see the bitch. So it's like more or less. But the conversation, I called her back. I called her back because I wanted to make it very clear. Like it's like, girl, when I did my first song, like what? I been did it before you put it out. And then uh, enough where she thinks that I copy her ad libs and whatever the fuck something with the beat. It's like, girl. This is the day that I I wanted I called her and we ended up the conversation on a very great note. We ended up the conversation on a great note. So I sent her, I don't know if y'all see this. The date is April 14, 2022. This is when I first received um the beat for enough, right? And I sent it to her. Okay. 
so this is when I first received the beat for um, Enough. And this is when I first recorded. I Don't make fun of me, y'all. I sounded chop. I was putting the words on it. So I sound crazy. I recorded enough. I recorded enough on May 18, 2022. I want y'all to see the date. I recorded enough May 18. The first time I ever put my vocals, May 18, 2022. You know, I really wanted to prove to her that like, yo, I never copied you. I never anything. So, you know, on that conversation, we ended up very well. She told me like, what was her issues with me? And I told her like, well, I never really have an issue with you and whatever. The conversation ended up great. It started off nasty and then it ended great. All right, cool. So fast forward, the enough, the enough um, video came out. She subbed me again after we just spoke a couple of days ago, like a couple of days ago, she subbed me again and she's claiming that like I copied a music video of hers and she posted the music video. Now, I'm actually going to show you my creative mood board that I did with patience because I want to prove to y'all that like everything that she claimed that I copied her from, I been did the songs and I would, when it comes to style, video, anything, I would never copy you, girl. I ain't, I'm not you, never you. Um, where's the documents? Where is it at? So this is when, no, hold on. Where is it? Uh, I want to make sure y'all got the right one. Not the scams. Because I was supposed to, I was supposed to put this song out last year. What is it, Little Bear? All right. So, okay. So, I was supposed to put the song out last year, right? And um, look at the date. 523. I don't want to show y'all my everything. Look at the creative. Hold on. Look at the creative, right? This is the creative for um, the Enough video. As y'all can see... This is the creative for the Enough video. I was supposed to do it last year, but we changed our mind, whatever. All right, cool. So, like I said, after we got off the phone and the music video came out, she claimed that I'm copying now with her the music video style. And it's like, oh. So, it was never about a misunderstanding. And it's, it is more than a phone call. Like, it's like, you doing internet shit, whatever. Whole point is, I ignored her. I ignored her, whatever. Then, fast forward, fast forward, I don't know if it's three weeks, a month, yeah, 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 make the dates, yeah, put the dates. Um, she put out, she put out this remix song and everything, and she threw slugs at me at the song, and it's like, oh, that's what you wanted to do. Okay, now I see, that's what you wanted to do. You wanted some type of beef with me that's what you wanted okay so i know that too you got your ten thousand fucking streams congratulations good for you i ignored it i whatever and i want to make this very clear before like what came out i have never subbed this girl never subbed her never dissed her on a song never played her i don't know her like that i never had an issue with her so y'all could go up and down Twitters, Instagram, never subbed her. Y'all can hear all my songs. I never subbed her, never this. I never had an issue with the bitch. So, like I said, fast forward, she she threw slugs on me on a song and everything. And it's like, oh, this is what it was about. You wanted to start some type of beef with me type shit. I ignored it too. I ignored it. I ignored it. Y'all saw me, I ignored it. I, don't, I didn't even give a fuck. Couple of weeks later... Couple of weeks later and everything, some girl from Atlanta, she's me and Offset's friend. She's me and Offset friend, and she hit somebody up from my team. Like, yo, 
she had somebody else on my team like, yo, um, there's this rumor going around that there's like a, a tape of Cardi, like a, a sex tape of Cardi. And I was like, me? Impossible, bitch. Impossible. There's n there's none. I'll pay. I told him like, it's like a sex tape of me. I'll pay somebody a million dollars cash. I wouldn't even wire it. I'll cash it. Don't even send it to my phone. Don't send it to my phone. Put it on social media. Put it out. Put it out. Because I know me. Y'all know me. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's like, whatever. So then, I'm like, fuck that. I want to talk. I, I, I hit up the girl myself. I'm like, yo, where's this woman coming from? And it's like, yeah, it's coming from shorty. It's coming from her. And it's like, huh? So I'm like, what do you mean? It's like, yeah, she showed a video to this producer that he's very close to Offset. Like, they're like this. And that she saw, and she showed it to another rapper. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to get to the bottom of it. So I called the producer, but he talks to Offset. And he told Offset, I ain't seen the video, but Shorty's saying that she got some shit on your bitch. And if your, your girl, like, reply back, like, like to whatever the fuck she put out, she's going to post the video or some shit like that. I'm like, all right, whatever. So I called the rapper, too, and the rapper is like, I ain't never heard nothing. So I'm like, you know what? I'm going to just keep it professional, and I'm going to get to the thick of it. Because I wonder if, like, I was wondering if it's like, if it's like a rumor that somebody's making up be because, you know, everybody knows that me and her are like not in the greatest, in the greatest thing. So I don't know if there's like a rumor that people's making up trying to be messy between me and her. So I got to the thick of it and I got my manager, call her manager and I'm going to show y'all. Because I don't, I don't play that shit. Think about you, that's that me and so. All right. So. Video or something. I don't know nothing about the video. She said I did. You like, say. Yeah. I remember saying that, though. Like, really trying to work you up. You gotta Yeah, I, I honestly feel like uh, it's somebody, uh, probably a messy, messy person from Atlanta. I feel like, you know. So, oh, I'm gonna show y'all naked pictures of me. So, whole point is, right? I was trying to get to the bottom of it. I want to know if she's saying it, or I want to know if it's somebody from, you know, just trying to be messy. So, it was like, okay, I, f I feel like maybe it was somebody trying to be messy, but I find it very weird because the producer is standing 10 toes down that she told him some shit about me. And it's like, Hmm, saying that ain't adding up. Like, I don't like this. Like, saying, saying ain't adding up. Like, hmm, saying ain't adding up. So fast forward, I put my record out. I put my record out. Yes, no, not my record. I put this remix out. And, you know, shorty feeling a certain type of way or whatever. So niggas send me this. They send me this. They send me her, her little diss record that she got. And this is what she's saying. Hold up. That's the me special. I don't play that shit. And y'all see how I come. Oh, uh, where is it? Where is it? What's shorty saying? Let me repeat it again. So now that I put things together, now that I think, now that I put things together, it's like, oh, so you was going around, you was going around telling people that it's close to my nigga that I'm fucking on niggas. And I thought that it was somebody trying to be messy, trying to start some shit between me and you. But now that I see the, t the fake diss record that you trying to put out, that was you all along. And it's like, this is my thing, right? There's so many... People on Twitter say so many crazy shit about me. They talk about my face. They talk I can't rap and this, this, and that. You could, you could come at me at any angle. You gonna lie on my pussy? Bitch, you lying on my fucking pussy? When you lie about my pussy, I'ma sue you. And you gotta come with receipts. 
And not only not social media receipts, you gotta come with court receipts. Cause one thing you're gonna you're not gonna do, you're not gonna lie on my pussy, and you're not gonna lie about me stepping out on my shit. There has been so many rumors about me, and I got so many fucking apps. I got so many apps. I got bloggers, there's apps. And, and oh yeah, yeah. And then she's saying this, right? Then she posted this on her little finsta. Hold up, I got it. She's talking about bitch, I'm not Tasha K. <laughs> girl. Ask Tasha K. She came, she could even lie on my pussy, girl. She could even lie. Ask her. Tasha K could even lie on my pussy. So how are you lying on my pussy? Hold up. Mm -mm. She's talking about this offense though. She's talking about good luck. You think I'm Tasha K. And she put some bullshit like this. And then she put in another song. I don't know if this, this song is about me or not. I don't care. Then she posted this, this thing. I don't know who's Adam, but she's talking about, hey, Adam. I can see it. Tell him the truth. The record I just paid y'all. Belkali said, if I drop this song, she's going to sue me. It, is that valid? Now, like I said, you could diss me. We could go battle for battle. But for you to lie on my pussy, and you know what's so crazy? Even before... I put out this remix and shit. You was trying to go around and tell niggas to get close to my nigga to put that lie about me. First, I want to I wanna make this very clear, right? I want to make this very clear. Sweetheart. My security is this close with my nigga. I got security. Every house that I stay in, I got security. That my man contracted, that he pays for me and my children's safety or whenever the fuck I go, he pays for it. So ain't no, any in and out movements that I do, my nigga know. Second of all, like I said, bitch, lying on my pussy, bitch, will get you sued. And I will get every little fucking red penny that you ever fucking make, bitch. Any money, every money that you make off your publishing, bitch. So find something safe to do, bitch. You And you want to talk about you, you not Tasha K. You're right. Ask Tasha K. She tried when, when she tried to lie that shit on me. What happened? Ask her. Ask her. You're not Tasha K, bitch. You're actually fucking dumb. Also, I just don't understand. Like, this is my thing. If any bitch want a rap battle or do whatever the fuck, more or less, I feel like she's so beneath me that I feel like I never had to. But it's like when you go around lying on me and lying on my pussy, and then it's like you doing top, you doing lies that is like you trying to mess with my home, like you trying to mess with my house, you trying to mess with my house. And it's like to me, like that's beyond rap shit. Like to me, that's like yo, that's some that's some real hating ass shit. And it's crazy because not only is that some real hating ass bitch shit, but it's like. I'm not perfect. My life is not perfect. You know what I'm saying? And I'm in a great place in my career. Whether I drop music or not, I'm still one of the top female rappers. The top female rappers. When I don't drop music or when I'm dropping music, I'm, the, I'm one of the most streamed and most talked about bitch. Even when I'm laying down at home. So that's one. However, when it comes to my career, I feel like I'm not. I have, I have, I have actually, I have a dream. I have a dream that I want to accomplish and I will never tell nobody and I'm going to tell you when I accomplish that dream. When it comes to my marriage, I don't have the perfect marriage. Y'all know what it is. I got my vices. Offset got his vices. We're not perfect. But one thing for sure is I'm rich as fuck. I'm successful as fuck in my career. I got beautiful kids. When it comes to my marriage, I don't got the perfect marriage. But one thing I have, I got a nigga that's that steps 10, 10 toes behind me on everything. Any nigga, matter of fact, Jason Lee just got on it. Ask him. Every nigga that ever try to play me on some internet shit or every nigga that try to play me in the streets, my nigga pressed or my nigga slapped. And y'all wouldn't even know about it. But people know what's up. My nigga all the time 10 steps behind me. When I got into this, this industry, niggas was stealing money from me. Stealing money from me. Ever since I got married, nobody has stolen money from me. No lawyers, no accountants, no nothing. I have a, I have a special bond with my nigga. Always. I'm going to always have a special bond with my nigga. 
it, look at stars, steps. Yeah, bitch, steps. We're not perfect. We're not perfect, but we got a bond. For you to try to come and lie on my pussy and, and say some shit like that. And it's like, oh, so, and then like you trying to put it on a song, bitch. Bitch, put it on a song and put, and put receipts out, bitch. Put receipts out. Put receipts out. Put it. Because you can't lie about my pussy with no fucking receipts. And when you lie about my pussy, make sure, make sure them shits is, is legit. Because, bitch, I'm going to take you to court. You could diss me all you want. You could talk about, oh, how I look, how I can't rap, blah, 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 whatever the fuck. I don't give a fuck. And since we here, go ahead. Go, go stream be a music. Give her some streams, guy. She needs, she needs to recoup her publishing. She, need, she needs to recoup her publishing. And I came here with all type of receipts. I will put I will put all the conversations up. I will put the conversations of me and her when we first talked on the phone. How I started it. It started off very nasty. It started very unprofessional. You know, I get ghetto. But we ended up the conversation very nicely. You still kept going to the internet dissing me. You went to the internet dissing me. You claiming after we had the conversation, you went and you started saying that I copied your music video. Then what else you did? Then you fucking did a record, you dissed me on it. All right, whatever, I ignore you. Then you going around lying about my pussy to, to my man's uh, 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 boys and shit. What? Now that I, that I said something about you, I addressed you on a song, is that, oh, so it was you that was going around saying that because you put it on a song. You want to go, I right, so I'm going to address you with it. I'm going to address you with it. I don't play that shit. There's the tension you wanted. You want streams. You want, I don't know. I'm going to share my platform with you. I'm going to share it here. Please go to her Spotify. Go to her, um, go to, go to her Spotify. Go to her Apple. It's crazy. Yo, it's so crazy. Like, and it's crazy because when I called her on the phone, I wanted, I wanted clarity. And that's exactly what we got. We ended the conversation with clarity, but you kept going. And the thing about it is that it's like, at first, when she kept dissing me after, I was like, damn, maybe she's doing it for clout. You know, I'm Cardi B. Bitch is going to always look for clout when it comes to me. But when she started doing that rumor shit, it's like, damn, it's more than clout. It's jealousy. It's jealousy because what bitch will lie on another bitch pussy? That's jealousy. What, what the bitch will lie about another bitch pussy? That's jealousy. That's some jealous hating bitch shit. You hate the marriage. You hate that I'm spoiled. You hate that a nigga that will beat a nigga up for me. You hate the fact that I'm 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 super successful, bitch. Unknown caller. Oh shit, that's my chef. Hold on. Hi, baby. Oh, you here? Okay. Um. Uh, hold on. I I'm gonna I'm gonna let my security know. Uh. Oh, oh yeah, oh, you you see me on live. I'm talking shit. I'm talking shit. Hold, wait, wait for me right there with that fool. Wait for me for wait, wait for me right there with that fool, honey. <laughs> he know I'm on live. He know I'm talking my shit. So, and bitches just hate on the fact that that is you, bitch. Bitches hate on the fact that people love you. Bitches hate on the fact that anything. And it's like I like it's like I'm just so baffled because I'm just so baffled. Like, hold on, let me let me replay it again. Cause you want to put like this is what you want to put out. So bitch, why you ain't telling the school? Why you ain't telling the school? You know all said why you ain't telling the school? Why you ain't telling them? Go ahead, tell them. Because you ain't had nothing to say, bitch. You want to take it to the internet. You want to put lies and shit. You want to get your little stream up. You want to get your shit up. Nipples. Somebody said nipples. It's always out. So, yeah. And I talk, and like I said, I talk, I talk with receipts, bitch. Real shit. But that's the type of shit that I be dealing with behind closed doors. I, I never even addressed it. All of this shit been happening the past, ever since I, I, I put out, like, what? Mind you, 
I never subbed this girl a day in her life. A day in her life. Actually, she has gone to a couple of people saying like, yo, I don't have a problem with Cardi. And I told my people like, yeah, I don't, I don't have a problem with her. I never had a problem with her. Like the internet is going to always make things a problem because you know how it is, like the choosing side shit. But I always like, you know, I always let her know to the, to the people that be like, yo, I don't have a problem with her. That is like, I don't, I don't ever have a, a, a problem with her. And I told her that shit on the phone because she brought, you know what? I'm not even going to say about nothing that, that the conversation that went on on the phone. Cause when time comes, I'm just going to put the whole 36 minutes. I'm going to put the whole 36 minutes. I don't got to talk about the things that we spoke on. All I got to tell you is that I know I proved my point. And my point was, I was trying to prove to her, like, yo, I never copied you. Like, you're never, you're never, the you never a thought in my head. Like, I don't, I don't want to dress like you. I don't want to look like you. I don't want to rap like you. I don't listen to your music. I don't know what the fuck you be doing, bitch, because I don't even look at you. You're like, you're not interesting to me. So, you might be interesting to somebody else. Like, I'm not saying that you suck or anything, like, but you just not somebody that I see. So, I just really wanted to get that shit very clear. But other than that, we talked about different type of things. And um, I'm not going to talk about that. I'm just going to like, you know, if she asked me to put the conversation, I'll put the whole conversation. Like, it's a 30, 40 minute conversation. I can make, you know, I can make money of it from YouTube, I guess, if y'all want to hear it. You know what I'm saying? And I will put the conversation of me and her manager, her manager saying like, yo, that rumor shit, like that shit is fake. Everything like everything everything we could put we could put the i could put the conversation with me and the girl saying it like yo yeah it came from yeah this girl is telling that to this producer and saying all of that i could do all of that like i got my shit step by step because one thing i noticed is that these bitches be lying and you gotta you gotta make sure that you got your shit now my chef chef is waiting for me outside i'm gonna eat and i'm gonna feast Stop playing with me.